Okay, thank you for checking out the uh, channel. Hope you enjoy the videos. Today's video is on more Amazon purchases. So, starting off with the Renogy Bluetooth module that you see on the screen here. Um, I purchased this and connected it to my charge controller, which is the one of the the Wanderer, the WND thirty Li is the one I have and it works great. I run the 100 watt solar panel connection with it. And uh, so this allows you to um, turn on Bluetooth on your phone, download the app, and then you can monitor your batteries from pretty good distance away. It says 82 feet, but uh, if you're camping and you just wanna check how your battery is charging, this is the best module for the Renogy uh, that I have. So, hope you enjoy it. I'll put the the uh, links in the description below for all these products. All right. So, next one we have is I purchased a just a portable camp light because I found that I didn't have enough light one in the in the ten by ten pop up for uh, camping and I and trying to run LED lights and strings and all that I just want something I want to be able to hang turn on and and go from there so we'll see how well this works I just bought it so um, we'll see if it's worth the investment or not okay next up we have just because you never have enough spatulas and stuff so I decided to buy a complete set because I didn't have a silicone set of spatulas for my Blackstone and for my nonstick pan when I take it for camping. So I purchased a set of this. Can never go wrong with these. Next we have a salt shaker or four-in-one container to put in all your spices and whatnot. Uh, the reason I bought this was because the one that I did, ha did have didn't have the openings large enough. It kept clumping up so it would just wouldn't come out very well. So I wanted to replace that. And we're going to try these and see how well these work. Uh, if you do have these, uh, let me know. Put, uh, put in the comments below and how, tell me how you like these. But that's what they are. It's a 4-in-1 spice container. And I bought it comes with two packs, so there you get two of them. You get one with a gray top and then one with a, a white top, just like you see here. Okay, next up is the prep containers. I'm going to try using these instead of plastic bags. It will add a bit of weight to my cooler. I know, I realize. Uh, I know you guys will go, but that's a lot of weight. But that's okay. I'm doing smaller meals anyway. And instead of trying to keep everything, you know, not only frozen, but separated from each other things, I'm going to use these. Hopefully we'll try it out next camping trip and uh, see how well it works with storing my food a lot better and not have soggy cheeses and meats and all that other stuff. So we'll see how well they go. If not, I'll use them at home. Next up is just a, uh, I was using for my bed in the trailer, uh, I just had a two inch memory foam topper that I was using that was folded over in half. And while it was comfortable, um, it, I needed a little bit more support. And so I bought this, bought the three inch uh, with the, so it's three inches high, 30 inches wide, 72 inches in length. Now I do have to cut it down because my trailer is only 69 and a half. So I had to cut it down just a little bit. But other than that, um, this added nice extra three inches of, of foam, slept a lot better. And uh, so if you need that, check out these ones. Okay, next up is something very simple. Uh, I know it doesn't seem like much, but it's just a tank splitter you put on your propane tank. And what this allowed me to do was uh, I was able to split um, my connection so I could do something very similar to this, where I was able to hook up my Blackstone and then hook up my 
camp stove as well. So I could run them both off of one tank. And it worked very well, worked perfect. So if you're if you're limited on trying to have carry one tank but you you need multiple things get a splitter and it worked great okay next up i just felt like this was a fun purchase for the fun of it just some silicone collapsible cubs you never know you always need extra cubs and since they're you know silicone you don't have to throw them away and um so reusable easy to pack and they come in some fun colors so if you have kids they'll like these okay next up is just an additional power supply i needed a spare one because i couldn't i found my original one but i i couldn't find it for a while and so uh for the jackery so i just made sure that i had a spare one so i leave one at home for when i want to charge it at home and then i leave one in the trailer when i need to charge it on the trailer in the trailer even though the jackery does come with a connection for plugging into 12 volt sometimes it works better if you're plugging into shore power instead but you never have a, can never have enough connectors or power chargers anyway okay next up very simple camp requirement just a collapsible dish draining dish one and so the only thing about that I didn't like about this one is that and it's not a bad feature it's just one that I wasn't <laughs> ready for is you see the little um, drain thing at the bottom well that's for your water to drain when your dishes are draining or, or drying and it doesn't plug so it will automatically just keep leaking so you don't want make sure you have that lip over the edge of your table instead of in the middle of your table because now you're going to get a bunch of water all over your table so just be aware of that but other than that it's a nice little collapsible thing easy to store in my kitchen box okay next up is i needed an adapter for to plug into my camp stove instead of hauling those one pound tanks around along with the big propane tank I wanted to just run off of the propane tank the big one and so by using the Y splitter that I showed you earlier and and then hooking this up to that and I can run my Coleman camp stove and my Blackstone all off of one tank instead of bringing those little one pounders all the time so uh, it worked great just make sure that you verify that this connection is the one that is perfect uh, for your camp stove it's the exact one that I have on mine I just wanted to, to convert it over all right next one is I just tried to keep my silverware in my kitchen my my kitchen box a little cleaner so all I have to do is pull this out and um, and it keeps my utensils nice and clean while it's in the storage and it's nice and flat fits in the tub just perfect and it uh, keeps all your utensils nice and clean all right last but certainly not least this one was kind of an impulse buy i just wanted i saw them online and i thought yeah you know what we'll try it we'll see what happens uh it did hold ice pretty well for the most part uh, I only had it, used it on one trip so far, but I'll use it on a second trip. I'll test it again and see how well it does work. So the jury is still out on this thing. But if you have used this, please uh, drop me a comment and let me know how well it worked for you. So, And uh, that is all the purchases for this video. Uh, I'll put a little link uh, in the description for all the products. So if there's anything you'd like, feel free to drop me a line. Again, thank you for watching Tiki's Travel Hut, and uh, have a good one. Bye.